those of you who don't know, this chair is like 1500 bucks. Herman Miller AEIOU 5000. And I bought this shit from a random cholo off the street who refurbishes them for 300 bucks <laughs> five years Thank ago. You. So I had to do some dad related stuff today. And I went to the 7 Eleven. He wanted MMs. So I went to the 7 Eleven. And I pull into the 7 Eleven. And. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sitting in the spot next to this other dude in a truck, and I'm sitting in this spot. I'm, a, I'm putting on my hazmat suit like I do anywhere. So I put on my Michael Jackson <laughs> glove. I use only one glove now because <laughs> I don't want to look weird. So uh, I, I put on my glove. I mask up. I'm getting ready to go in. And this fucking dude is staring a lot, you know? And people stare all the time, really. People stare. So I'm not worried about it. I'm putting on my hazmat suit. The guy's staring at me. All right, fine. I notice he's staring. Judge eyes, exactly. So I put on the suit, and uh, he, at this point, he went in. He went in. So I got out, and I looked in, in the bed of his truck, and I saw three Herman Miller chairs, exactly like the one I sit on every day. Huh. I go in. I kind of forgot about it. I saw that, and I go. I was thinking about my dad, right? So I was, I was focused on my mission. So I put my hazmat suit on. Uh, I go in. I get the M and M's. I get the fucking chips, whatever he wanted. I pay for him. I literally at this point forgot about the guy. I stopped thinking about him. <laughs> Just some you. random dude staring at me. He's got Herman Miller's. Whatever. <laughs> so I pay for my shit. <laughs> And I'm Thank walking you. back out, and the guy's staring again. You don't want to stare at cholos. You don't stare back at cholos. So I'm not going to, like, do a fucking Mexican showdown with this random cholo who's got Herman Miller's. And then I do. I decide, you know what? This guy's staring a shitload. So I'm going to do it. So I fucking did the showdown. And I looked at him, and I was like, hey, you selling those chairs? And he's like, no, man, I'm not. And then I looked at him more and I gave him the judge eyes and I said, hey, did I buy some fucking, did I buy a Herman Miller from you five years ago? He's like, yeah, you did. I remembered you. You play video games. Give me your phone number. I got his phone number. The guy who steals Herman Millers and sells them for cheap on the streets. I found him. It was him. I can't believe it. I found that shit from a random like fucking Craigslist ad five years ago. It was the guy. He's like, yeah, man, I got you. Call me up. <laughs> I was like, dude, <laughs> I you. will. So sick. So that's tight. I found that guy. Uh, I put him in my phone as Herman. <laughs> Fuck. I was getting ready to, like, consider paying for one full price. Because, I mean, how long are you... The thing's starting to get a little bit old, you know? It's still good. I still use it every day, but, you know, I figured maybe get ready to buy one. And then, hell no, out of the sky? Woo, awesome. Anyway, I'm pumped about that. What do you guys got going on? Happy Big Friday. What are the chances of that? Five years later... And like 30 miles in a different place. Man, I'm so glad I said something. That's the thing. I mean, <laughs> I could have got in my car and drove away. What does he give a fuck? Same with me. Plus, we're both wearing masks. I'm easier to spot, though, you know, than some fucking cholo. Man, I mean, the, the only, if I didn't see those Millers, I wouldn't have known. He knew, but... I mean, five years ago, I don't know. It worked out. It worked out perfectly. What do you guys got going on? So, yeah, I got visited by a fucking cholo Mexican angel today. Wow. I was, I, I was like, I can't believe it, dude. <laughs> I've been thinking about you. I made that guy appear. I swear I've been thinking about that guy lately. I even talked about him on stream. I've been thinking about that guy because I needed a fucking chair. 
And I was like, how the hell are you going to randomly run into some fucking dude that steals Herman Miller's? You know? How are you going to run into that? I conjured him. Yeah, dude, I did. I think so. I can't believe it. That's so sick. Anyway, I'll hit him up. Maybe I'll buy two. He remembered me too. <clears throat> it's nothing sexual. I mean, why you guys always got to sexualize everything, especially when it's gay? God, dude, you guys really got to just keep it together. I know there isn't a lot of stuff to play. If you're not into Final Fantasy or uh, PoE, what else can you do but make up fanfics about me having a homosexual relationship with a cholo who steals and sells Herman Miller chairs? Sure. But, I mean, at least keep it to yourself. 